Do you know how to use a Valvoline DPF cleaner? Why it's important, how to do it, what to look for? My name is Dan and I have the answers. The first thing to do is diagnose that there is definitely a fault with the DPF. This job is typically carried out by a workshop technician. You will need to know where to install this cleaner. More technical information may be needed. If you are happy to continue, please follow these instructions. Before you use this product, ensure that the engine has cooled down to below 50 degrees C. Shake can well to ensure the contents are mixed thoroughly. Now locate the pressure sensor or temperature sensor, typically an exhaust manifold post-turbo. This sensor will need to be removed to allow the cleaner to be applied. Fit the accessory spray nozzle tube to the top of the can. With the sensor removed, insert the spray nozzle into the port and spray three to five times every five seconds. Repeat until the can is empty. Remove the spray nozzle and insert the sensor back into the exhaust. Start the car and allow it to idle for 15 minutes. Now take the car on an extended road test for 30 minutes. Some steam or liquid may be released as the product completes its cleaning regime. Sometimes one clean may not be sufficient. It is possible that the DPF may be blocked completely. If this is the case, then a professional clean or replacement will be needed.